That was, that was, I, I, more, more. The kid's good. Listen. I could help him with this too. Houdini, that little boy's lost. If you really want to help him, why don't you ask him where he lives? <laughs> Charlie, look, it's a miracle. Why not ask him yourself? Now that would be a miracle. One miracle coming up. Of all the arrogant, presumptuous, egotistical mods I've ever met! Now you talk. You must be an angel. Hey, Charlie, you used up your miracle, and that was supposed to be for an emergency. Seemed like an emergency to me. You must be my guardian angel. You what? My mom told me everyone has a guardian angel. You're here because I ran away from home, right? Uh, sure. Right, kid. We're gonna make some team, huh? You mean, you're not lost? Not anymore. I got my guardian angel. Now hold it. I want to know why you ran away. You tell her. This ought to be good. It's, uh, um, uh, you're having, uh, <laughs> kid problems? Yeah, with my stepmom. Knew it. Yeah, I knew it. She wants me to call her mom, but she's not. I'm never going home again. So what do you plan to do? Live on the street? Yep. And do my magic at Cannery Square. Of course, give you money. Now you know that's silly. Come on, tell me where you live. No. Okay. Don't listen to me. Listen to your guardian angel. David, Cannery Square sounds like a good plan to me. What? Don't listen to him. He's not ready to go home. Oh, come on, he's only eight years old. 56 in dog years? David, with your talent, there's no telling where you'll oh, end. please. No, no, you must have faith. Guardian angels move in mysterious ways. So we're off to Cannery Square? Not Cannery Square. Easy Street. Yes! You with us, Sasha? I don't know what you're up to, but I'm gonna keep my eye on you. I wouldn't want it 